What's up, everybody? I'm Myra Flynn, creator of Homegoings, the Vermont public podcast featuring candid conversations about race with artists of color. The artists I interviewed are so prolific and so talented that earlier this year, we put two and two together and asked ourselves, why don't we stage a live performance so folks can see some of this art? We did just that, and of course, we filmed it. In the spirit of curiosity, we topped off the evening with an open discussion that was, in fact, incredibly open. No topic was off the table, and there was no such thing as going too deep. These are the conversations that are our birthright to have and the stories we are lucky to hear. This is Homegoings. Welcome home. So tonight, Tomlinson Sound is described as unapologetically genreless. Her musical comparisons range from Florence and the Machine to Led Zeppelin. So, you know, that. <laughs> a homegoing is actually a funeral. It's an African American tradition where we send our loved ones who passed on home. That's the belief, they're going home. While we were creating this series, it was just too big and too much to talk about all of black grief all at a time. So we decided to build a house. The house has these pillars. Grief or mourning, right? Joy, rage, and healing. Because that is the way that black people grieve. It is not one way. It is all of those things walking alongside one another. And tonight, I asked her, do you identify with grief, rage, joy, or healing? As if those are the only options. And she said, all of them. Of course, and then she invited another one. She said, I wanna, I wanna invite numbness. Numbness, yeah. Perhaps that's the door to this house because that's how we get through. Tonight, Tomlinson, everyone. So I guess you're all aware now that you're not at a performance, yeah? As Myra said, welcome to our ceremony. We have an altar set up over here. We have the water for the ancestors. So my set is dedicated to uh, those we have lost and the badass black musicians and artists and poets that you will be uh, hanging out with tonight. Baby, my baby, my baby, my darling, I will be, I will be, I will be waiting for, waiting for, waiting for you to come home. Baby, my baby, my baby, my darling, I will be, I will be, I will be waiting for, waiting for, waiting for you. If 
Spanky Roman on the drums. One more for you.
love with both these men. <laughs> This community here, we may be small, but we are mighty. And we do not shut the fuck up. And every single black person on the stage tonight has put themselves out in a way that has hurt friends, relationships with friends, relationship with family, relationship all over, as we use our platforms to provide a space for those who cannot speak, those who cannot speak because of their jobs and those who cannot speak because they are dead. We are tired. We are tired, tired, tired. It's time for us to actually be able to pull back and not in a segregated way, in a way that like we take care of our own and then we can come back together. And then we can come back together. So you turn inwards on your community and you fix your cousins, your uncles, your fathers, your mothers, your aunts, your sisters, your third cousin four times removed, so that we can like hang out at my house so I can make them Ethiopian food, huh? and we can like take a breath. Thanks so much for joining us. If you want to continue to be a part of the Homegoings family, stay in touch at homegoings.co and subscribe to the Homegoings podcast wherever you listen. Take good care.